Hello fellow engineers and welcome back to Super Auto Pets. Now I have a staggering 25 hours in this game. <coughs> and I've got lots of wins, I've got 49% of the achievements, etc, etc. But it got me wondering, am I actually any good at this game? So I'm going to go in versus mode. I'm going to create a private game and I'm going to enter the max player count. 9999... Oh, 64. 64! My game name is going to be... How long of a game name can we type into this bar? Question mark. And then I can copy that with this button. And then I just need to find 64 people to join me. So I'm going to ask my 5,219 server members of my Discord. Oh dear, I'm going to do the unthinkable and say at everyone. Wait, are you sure you want to ping everyone? Yes, I'm sorry. All right, it's done. Now let's watch the carnage commence. Surprisingly, only four angry RCE pings so far. All right, back in Super Auto Pets HQ. People are rocking in now. We're up to 20 already. All right, so the final few are joining oh there's one more person to go and then i think it will start straight up and basically we're like playing a knockout sort of series thing uh, i'll show you how it works so same old same old except you will notice we've got 15 lives and bottom right we've got a timer so the turn will end if the timer goes down to nothing so i'm gonna start mosquito is always a good shout and probably an ant at the dart we will roll oh look and then we'll go i think we'll go another mosquito freeze the ant and i might freeze the honey and then we'll end our turn and pick our name and we're gonna be the overpowered monks all right so you can see the time has gone down to zero which means we enter the first round we just pick one of those random 64 people this time it's brie cheese with the innocent rodents so i'm sorry i completely annihilated that oh it's a draw though it's a draw and then you can see here this is everyone that's in uh, loads of people with 15 lives and then quite a few people with 14 because they lost so now we're on to our next turn we'll shove an ant up there we'll roll again oh we're gonna shove another ant in and then we're gonna put honey at the back and that's the end of our turn 20 seconds left the overpowered monks we need the power of the ant oh they've got ants at the back oh they're both dead <laughs> Well, unfortunately, because I killed their ants first, it means they weren't useless. They would have been, but uh, it looks like we've won thanks to the bee. Nice. Still on 15 points. Let's see what we've got this turn. Tier 2 animals are unlocked, so I think we'll stack up the ants. We've got a sheep. We'll shove you in. And then I might put a spider in and then give him a sleeping pill. That will faint him, but we get the tier 3. Oh, and it's kangaroo. Okay. So if we do a bit of that... That should be semi-decent. I might just roll and try and get another mosquito. Oh, there's another ant there. I don't want another ant. I want a mosquito now. One more roll. Oh god, there is a swan. I'll freeze the swan. Extra money is always good. I'll tell you what, I might freeze the sleeping pill as well. We might get rid of the ant next time. All right, let's end our turn and wait for our opponents. Oh, these guys have a background. That means they're semi-decent. Oh, Lander. So we got rid of their ant. Oh, look, they've got pay to win. I don't know what that is. It's a fish of some description. I don't know what it does. Why not a bird? Damn pay to win architects. Right, okay. Time to do a bit of this then. I think we do... That's the mosquito. Get the swan in. And then I'm going to get rid of the ant. Now... Yeah, I'm going to do it now. Oh, why did you go to the mosquito? Oh, anyone but him. Anyway, let's keep rolling till we get something good. Oh god, we got nothing. We got absolutely nothing. Right, I might just shove a flamingo in for now. Really not ideal, but... It, it is what it is, I guess. I tell you what, actually, I might do that. So I've just moved the kangaroo to go behind the mosquito because he's got higher hit points and he's got the B. So that's an extra two attacks ahead. So he should gain at least four and four. But ideally, it will be a little bit more than that. But we can also see everyone's team as well. So we can see how everyone's getting on. Very sneaky. I'm not going to look at this too much. Maybe towards the end when there's not as many people left. All right, here we go. We're against... The sticky chunks. Gross. Right, we're doing... Oh, God. Our thing died. Our mosquito died instantly. Although, I think we should win thanks to the rams. Oh, no. Oh, no, it's a draw. I could not call that one. It was all over the place. Now, what other names do we have? The chunky balls. <laughs> I'll look forward to playing them. All right, here we go. Tier 3 animals are unlocked. Now it gets serious. Uh, do I put another sheep in? I don't really rate the sheep. Sod it. It's in there. Let's roll. Oh, look, another sheep. Oh, we got an early skunk. All right, okay. I'm going to pill the flamingo. I don't think the skunk's worth putting in now. Sounds stupid, but I think I'm better off just putting another swan in because that gives us extra money next time. The thing is with the skunk, it reduces the highest health 
health enemy by 33%. This early in the game, the enemies are pretty low, so 33% isn't actually that good. This is more a late game sort of animal, but uh, I think we'll leave it like that. I think that looks semi-decent. I do want to get rid of that mosquito ASAP though. All right, here we are then. We are versus the pouting rodents. Oh, they've got a rat as well. Dirty rat. It killed our swan. Although, look at this. Look at this. Our kangaroo is getting hench. 9-9. Nine, nine. Rip through those. I think we've got another win here. Nice. And the rat joined us as well. All right, another victory. How many people are still on 15 wins? Oh, not too many. About six or seven. All right, I might shove another kangaroo in. I'm wondering when do I get the skunk? Oh, look, another kangaroo. Love to see it. Love to see it. Uh, squirrel, don't really rate it, if I'm honest. I might just freeze the salad bowl and then try and get another mosquito. Oh, I'll tell you what, though. A turtle. A turtle could come in handy. Two turtles could come in very handy. Yeah, I think all I'm going to do is that. And I might lose this one. I haven't really strengthened my team too much. It depends who it puts me up against. It could be anyone from those 64 people. Who's doing the worst? Oh, someone's already out. Oh, Pops Ollie. I'm sorry. I think he must have quit because most people only have six lives left. It, are the peculiar? Peculiar kilts playing with no one. Not the best tactic. All right, here we go then. The vague cakes. Oh, they've got melon armor. Not anymore. Thank you, mosquito. Love to see it. Love to see it. All right, 13, 13. Oh, no. Oh, yes, yes. I was going to say we've lost that because I saw that massive fish at the back. But no, thankfully, we've got another victory. So victories in this don't matter. It's all just who has the lives remaining at the end. So it might be time to combine a swan. We'll get a turtle in. Then we'll roll. Oh, God. We'll roll again. There you go. Sleeping pill on the turtle onto the swan. We'll bung another swan on top of there. Oh, and we got an alligator. Sorry, a crocodile. That's very offensive to that creature. Uh, I think we might shove him in, you know. So he's in. That's sorted. Next time we're going to get rid of the mosquito we're going to give someone else melon armor maybe the skunk we'll get the skunk involved next time i think let's end our turn all right so who are we up against the moist bananas oh yes look we're going to kill the badger and the badger's going to kill the dodo oh i didn't kill it you lucky lucky bastard anyway that gets rid of the melon armor we've got some rams easy win i'm afraid easy win yeah and there's only four of us with 15 lives remaining. Oh man, another bloody turtle. All right, I think we get rid of the mosquito now. So I'm sorry, mosquito, but you're gone. We're gonna shove the turtle in. I might freeze that one as well, you know. Give our swan some health. We'll do a little roll. Oh my god, this so right, sod it. I'm just going double turtle. Oh look, we got a cow. We got a cow. But right, I really want to get my skunk involved because I feel like it's that time of the game. I might have to lose the kangaroo, you know. I think we put him there anyway. Yeah, let's see how that goes. All right, who's at the back? It's a badger. Yes, and it's going to kill the monkey in front. Oh yes. <laughs> Oh, the crocodile is quite good this early on in the game because everyone's sort of starting to get badgers, but they're not, they haven't got eight health yet. They can't survive the crocodile. Now look at our kangaroo as well. 17, 17. Oh, this is quite a good team. There's only three people with 15 lives left and I am one of them. Right, we're on the tier five animals. Let's have a look at these top guys. There is one badger that's likely to survive. There's so many badgers though, so I might keep my crocodile one more round. Oh, I don't know who to get rid of. Maybe I'll keep the sheep. The sheep's doing me all right. I might sleeping pill the turtle. Yeah, I'll do that. Sleeping pill turtle. That gives those two melon armor. We'll shove the cow in and we'll give milk to my swan. He's going to become our tank. Now I'll roll once more. There's nothing I like there too much. So I might sell the cow for the skunk or a parrot. All right, sell the cow, shove the skunk in. I'm going to freeze the parrot. So that's what I might replace the crocodile with or maybe the kangaroo. One more roll. Oh no, no. I ran out of time. I didn't freeze the chocolate in time. <laughs> oh, I'm an idiot. I wasted three coins and chocolate. But we seem to be ripping through this team okay-ish. We got a 17-17 kangaroo. I think I do need to keep the kangaroo. He's making it fairly easy for me. To be honest, the crocodile's doing really good as well. Oh, look, another skunk. I right, will definitely do that. All right, I need to be quicker. I need to be quicker. Let's... Let's roll. Let's level up the skunk. We got a boar. Don't really care for the boars, if I'm honest. So I might just roll again. Nothing I want there. One more roll. Or do I do I chili someone? Now let's roll once more. I'm going to chili the skunk. And then next time I'm going to get rid of the crocodile for the parrot to go behind the skunk. I think. I feel like the crocodile has been quite good to me. Oh man, there's a lot of people out now. The weak have been cold. There's a lot of people on two lives. Now at the moment, I think we're losing three lives around. So essentially, they're out of it. So let's see who we're up against. The suspicious riders. I've killed his deer before it gets wailed. No, not quite. Although I think that's a 
pretty easy win in my book. Oh, 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 it's a little bit tight. It's a little bit tight. No, don't worry. I've got it. I've got it. It's in safe hands. We're in safe hands. There's only two people with 15 lives left as well. Thankfully, I am one of them. And tier six animals are unlocked. This is where it gets a bit serious. Is it now time to lose the crocodile? Yeah, so that crocodile's gone. Parrot is in. We're going to roll. Oh, look, tiger and a snake. Okay, so my team's changing completely now. We're doing you at the front. I might sell the kangaroo. Sell the kangaroo. I'm selling the sheep as well. This is ridiculous. Snake's going in. Tiger's going behind him. We're going to put melon armor on the snake. We're going to roll. And then I'm going to freeze that skunk. No, I'm not. I'm just going to use the skunk. All right, that's a complete complete change of tactics i've wiped my entire team but hopefully for the better we'll probably lose this just so you know all right so my thinking here is swan's pretty hench we should get a few hits off with the snake and then the tiger will make him do it twice so look at this double hits and again double hits kangaroo's dead double hits oh it's it's a good plan it was a good plan <laughs> I've still got the 15 wins. Come on. Right, and now we've got 12 coins to do some damage. So let's sushi up. Let's get a parrot involved. I might freeze the swan just in case. I really want melon armor. Oh, or chocolate. Oh, or leopard. Right, leopard is going to be very good, potentially. I might freeze that. I'm going to give chocolate to the parrot. Oh, yeah, there's another leopard, which means we're probably going to have to get rid of our swan. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I want everyone in this team. Don't you hate it when you have too many favorites? Now the parrot's on level two. Two of their enemies at the start will lose 50% of their health. The two biggest ones, which means this could be very good. Trouble is our swan really isn't that beefy. Like I've gone all out attack. I've got like no defense, basically. I'm a bit worried if they've got leopards. My team's like dead. Oh, thankfully no leopards. Oh, there you go. The badger's dead. It's going to kill their turkey. Nice. Both the bees are down. The rhino's down. And we just got that to go. Nice. We didn't have a lot of strength left at the back. Ooh, although now we've got melon armor. Let's shove that on probably the tiger, actually. Right, we've got to get the leopards involved. I don't know when to lose the swan. I feel like the swan's the best one to lose. So I might unfreeze that and then roll. Oh, look, there's another leopard. We can do... We can level up our leopard straight away. Shall I do that? Shall I lose the swan? Yeah, let's do it. This is risky as anything. I'm going to freeze a pizza i'm gonna roll oh i got another skunk we'll freeze that because once we have a level three skunk these leopards are gonna do some damage i tell you that much all right i've put the tiger behind the leopard as well because i feel like let's just spray damage everywhere you know i'm massively lacking in hit points so this this is quite ridiculous <laughs> i'm probably gonna lose oh look look at that ant it's gonna get annihilated by my skunk and suddenly it's an even battle oh and look at that we have won <laughs> that was a tight one that was a tight one we're the only person with 15 lives and i completely wrecked my team all right skunk goes in i don't know if it's worth keeping the snake now oh well, let's pizza up see it goes to it goes to those two that's fine i will freeze both of those just in case i might give mistake now i'm not gonna stake I want melon armor. Oh, come on, melon. All right, pair to the leopard. We've got to lose one now, surely. Surely. This team is good, but it really isn't great. I don't deserve to be top. Hey, look how low the hit points are. I got a 4-3 tiger. So I'm the real tiger. It's a baby tiger cub or something. All right, here we go then. We are against the chunky bulls, finally. All right, goodbye, crab and ox. You got annihilated. Or oh, splash damage. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes. We got rid of that bus without it splash damaging us. We've just got to get rid of this guy now. It's a draw. Oh, it's a draw. <laughs> I've still got the 15 lives. Come on. Come on. Oh, look. There it is. There it is. There's the melon armor. Onto the leopard. Uh, I think I will level up the old snake, you know? And then sushi. And then we'll roll. Oh, more melon armor. Yes, please. We'll freeze that. And end turn. We've got a minute left. We're just waiting on everyone else now. Let's see what the other teams are up to. Cool, lively. That is a big camel. I feel like the loose baguettes could do some damage as well. They got a 50-50 fish in there. Yeah, that is a big team. Although our skunk would probably deal with it. Yeah, there's some dangerous teams in there. But here we go. We're against the withering abs. They got a big old seal at the front. Although it's not very big anymore. I'll tell you that. Come on, snake. Ooh, he's got his own snake. Ah, oh, it's doing damage. Thankfully, I think we've... Oh, that's a big cat. That is a big cat. Oh, we've won. We've won again. We've still got 15 lives. We're looking good. Right then, melon armor to the bird. And then we'll roll. Oh, look, we got chocolate. I might 
do the skunk. Yes. That reduces the highest health enemy by 99%. Basically puts them on one health, uh, which is fantastic. I might just roll three more times and try and get a snake, tiger, leopard, or a parrot, I guess. Or chocolate. So nothing, nothing. And the last one is nothing. Great. Glad I did that. All right, we're against the extra housewives. Oh god, they got a 50-50 camel. But look, the skunk took it down to one health. Now we got rid of their melon armor, which is nice. I think we might be okay. Oh, it's tight, but we just about won again. Oh man, another victory. Oh look, we got a skunk now, but we don't need it anymore. We've got chocolate. I don't know who to give it to, if I'm honest. I'm tempted to go the parrot, because that'll be two of their highest enemies down to one health. Oh, I was hoping for a parrot there. Another roll. Okay, a snake is good and chocolate is very good. We'll freeze both of those. We got one more roll. Nothing. All right, here we go then. Oh, they've got their own skunk. Thankfully, shouldn't matter too much because we haven't got many hit points either. Although splash damage here could hurt. Ow, it got rid of my melon armor. We might be in trouble. Yep, we're in trouble. Our first loss. It's okay, it's okay. We got lots of lives remaining. We got 12. 12 hearts. All right, so chocolate on the parrot. Beautiful. Snake on the snake. Oh, I really want to use cats. Cats are really good. Uh, let's roll... And there's nothing too good there. I don't think it's worth using any of those. I might move my skunk to the front though. Just purely because it's got the chili. I'm sort of thinking once we've done the 99 health. If it's the front two we could wipe them out in one hit. Uh, I'm just going to roll the rest and try and get a tiger really. Or something like pizza could be good. Bit of hit points finally. Yeah nothing. The rolls aren't being very good to us. We've still got a level one tiger. I'm wondering if I've done this right actually. Whether the other order was better. I don't know we'll see. We will see. The hippo's down to one health and we're going to splash damage it. Oh, it's dead anyway. And the badger, you can't hurt me. You cannot hurt me, mate. Oh, there you go. Finally a tiger. We'll shove you on. We'll do the pizza. Oh, and chocolate. There we go. Let's put that on the tiger. And then we're good to end our turn. Do we stay this way round? Or are these better off at the back? I don't know. I think we'll leave it like that for now. We'll give it one more try, but I think it's going all right. I'm still winning. That's the main thing. Now, how many people are left, actually? Oh, oh. It's like, look, everyone's dead. <laughs> seven left. Ho, ho, ho. I'm in the top seven. I'll take that. Right. Oh, God. Look at the melon armor. Thankfully, the splash damage. I was going to say we'll get rid of it, but we got rid of it anyway. We are going to lose this one. We are going to lose. Ah. We lost. That was that was a big team. That seal did the damage. Oh, look, melon armor. Okay, I'm putting melon on the skunk and we're moving the skunk back to the back with the parrot. I feel like this, this order worked better. Uh, pizza, I may as well roll. Oh, look, another tiger will freeze you. I may as well pizza and then roll twice more. So anything good. Oh, another leopard. We'll have that. Maybe I'll freeze the sushi. No, I think chocolate's better. Chocolate, not sushi. It's what I do in real life. It's what I'm doing in this game. All right, so who are we up against now? Oh, God, look at that team. All the 50-50s. Thankfully, they're both... Just one and one. Hang on, what happened to that parrot? That parrot didn't work as intended. I'm in the top five. What happened to you, parrot? Copyability... Pet head. I swear there weren't two one and ones on there. Something went wrong. Something went wrong. Anyway, leopard, you're up. I'm going to roll. Oh, I was hoping to get another leopard. Well, it doesn't really matter now. I may as well tiger and then just roll the last three. So many skunks. Nothing good in that roll. I'm feeling a bit nervous now. Six health. We basically got two lives. Everyone's got very big teams. We might beat this one because look how low their team is now. <laughs> Go on, snake. Do the damage. Do the damage, Snake. Oh, bloody... No, the Rhino. No. Oh, how did I win that one? Right, I'm sort of thinking, do I want to mess the order up? Right, I really just need two chocolates. There's one. I don't know who to use it on. I know whatever one I use, the other one will come up. I guess that one. Come on, chocolate. Chocolate or leopard, please. Oh, no. That means we've probably lost... There's the chocolate. Oh, who are we up against? How many people are left? It's just five. Sudden death for two of us. And looking at all of those numbers, like that guy's team is just nuts. I think we've lost it. We had a good run. It's like in F1 when you see like the guy out front, he like leads the entire race and then he loses on the last lap. That's what it feels like. That's what it feels like. Oh, the bloody melon armor. It ruined my skunking. Well, there we go. We came, we came fifth. Fifth out of 64. I feel like that's not too bad. Oh, but yeah, that was that was awesome fun. Definitely recommend that if you've got 64 friends to play with. Or like me, 5,000 people to ping. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. <laughs> anyway, peace, love, and failed skunks, I guess. Bye.